Hello, Jim Howard here in Fort Worth, Texas. Today's date, it is June 27th of 2018. And as you can see here on the screen, I just ordered this, just received this a couple minutes ago. It's the uh, Dash Keyboard 4 Professional. It's a mechanical keyboard, uh, German engineered, uh, dedicated media controls. That's up here, and this is supposed to be really nice. It's a knob to adjust that even clicks. Uh, two port super speed USB 3.0 on this. Uh, I was going to point here, but uh, well, you can see it here. Let's see. Nope. Nope. Okay, it's uh, you know it's in here. You're going to see it in a minute. And uh, detachable foot bar ruler that goes underneath it. That's underneath the uh, thing to raise it up a little bit. Has full N key rollover. Okay, it does not have lighting. There is no lighting. It uh, also does not have any programmable keys. It is a gaming keyboard, but it's a gaming keyboard because of the fast action and uh, what have you, not because of lighting or not because of programmable keys. Uh, what's nice about the Okay, the two things it does not have, it does not have lighting, no programmable keys. Uh, the nice things, apparently the keys, well, I've had a mechanical keyboard before. Uh, I forget what color, brown or, you know, blue or what, I can't remember. Uh, one thing that's nice about this is that the USB port, uh, Another keyboard that I had, well, the one that just broke, by the way, and that's why I ordered this one. You know, the cable that came off from it had two USB connectors. One plugged in for the keyboard and used up one of your USB ports on your desktop. The other plugged in to power the uh, USB 2.0. And this is a USB 3.0, and you just need the one cable, USB cable goes in. And then you have two that are 3.0, uh, extra long cable. So let's take a look at it. Let's see, I don't think this is taped. No. I looked at the YouTube videos of this, and everybody gives it uh, rave reviews. I think I opened it up, I did, upside down. Oops drop the little tiny instruction sheet. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Here is the, uh, it goes on the back, it has magnets. Or not the back, it's gonna go on the, well, the bottom of the uh, keyboard. Raise it up slightly. And it's a ruler, by the way, in case you uh, happen to find yourself needing a ruler. Let's put this there. There we go. And of course, it feels fantastic. This is aluminum. Aluminum top. One of the reviewers said it was sharp. I don't see it. Wait a minute. No, that's where the, uh, okay. That's where your two USB ports are 3.0 by the way so let's go ahead and put this on the back there we go so I guess uh, I guess you want to hear how loud it is not too well I have earphones on <laughs> Not too loud. Keys really feel good, of course. I thought it'd be loud. Let me let me do it with no 
Oh, okay. Yeah, it is louder, of course, with. Uh, so you're going to know when you hit the key. This, by the way, clicks. Well, I can't hear that. I have, by the way, I've had bad hearing, by the way, anyway. Okay, what I'm going to do is stop here and actually hook up the uh, keyboard. So don't touch the mouse. Okay, I'm back and I'm glad you stuck around. I now have the keyboard hooked up. Uh, let me maybe switch to this camera here. Okay. I now have the keyboard hooked up. And As you can see, no, you know, no programmable keys and no lighting. I was thinking that the volume control here clicked. I can't hear any clicking, but uh, it, you know, does go up and down. Then you have, you know, the normal other keys to put the. Uh, computer into sleep you can just hit the the sleep key and uh, there you have it a nice looking you know nice looking keyboard uh, let me go back and put this up here echo off not sure what I said but So I have uh, the keyboard hooked up, one cable. Unlike the keyboard that I had, which is the, uh, I have a number of keyboards. This uh, was the Razer Black Widow Ultimate, Ultimate, Ultimate 2014 model. And is, is usually normal when you have a hub or whatever, this has two USBs, one for powering the keyboard and one for the port. And uh, like I said, this keyboard, you just have the one, and not only do you have the one that does both, you have two USB ports and they are 3.0. Now you do not have to have a uh, this plugged into a USB 3.0 to use the keyboard. But if you want the full power of USB 3.0 hub, then you would need to have it plugged into a USB th you know, 3 from your computer. Um, as you can, so I have it plugged into the, to the hub. I have the camera. Let me switch cameras here. I have two cameras hooked up, by the way. Uh, not to the hub, the only one. That's the uh, Logitech. Forget the model number. Uh, that's the one that's the 4K that sells for almost $200. Have it plugged in. And then I have uh, the mouse that I uh, am using. It's plugged in to the hub. Uh, now with the camera plugged in, it makes it give me more cable for that camera, so I can move the uh, I'll be able to move the camera around a lot if I want to. Um, so here is a, you know look at the keyboard. Here's the information about it. I'll put links to. Uh, their website and you can see all of the uh, various things that they have one thing they have uh, on their site is a typing speed test or something and you can um, type and it'll tell you how many words per minute you're doing and you actually are competing against a couple other people 
so this is qu equipped with uh, Clicky Cherry MX keys. Uh, gives you information about the speed. Laser etched keys. Aluminum top. Uh, for rollover, it's I don't and an NKRO uh, for faster typing speed. An instant sleep button to save energy. Uh, here's your Cherry MX mechanical keys. They have a clicky tactile bump. I guess. Oh, let's. Well, in a minute you'll. Um, two USB ports. There they are. And laser etched keys. I think I said that. Down here on the Amazon page, and I'll put a link to this. If you purchase, by the way. I will get a small commission. Uh, shows some of their different keyboards and shows, you know, the differences uh, between them. This one here is the one that I have, the DOS Keyboard 4 Professional Ultimate. And uh, so let's go to... Well, let's, let's hear some typing. So let's go here. Feels good really does and all the other YouTube reviewers every one of them I, th I think I watched about six or seven reviews of this keyboard before I purchased it all of them just raved about this the only thing they said that you know some of them, well everybody commented that you have no lighting and the, I think I don't think any of them cared uh, same with the programmable keys um, there was, what was it? Because uh, I was going to say, I can't remember. There was uh, somebody, I can't remember now what, what it was. Oh, uh, maybe that was in the, in the Amazon review. It got, I think, four and a half stars. You can check. Well, here, I can check for you here. To go to home. Here we go. Uh, four and a half. That's really good. And you have 1,129 reviews. There's 169 <laughs> questions were asked. Um, in the reviews, they were they were really good. There was one or two people that said that the edge of the tin here was sharp and that you could cut yourself I I don't see that so they might have I don't see that what was the other anyway check out the you know check out the reviews um, I like it it's a keeper this also is a mechanical the old one mechanical keyboard then I had another, and I re don't remember what mechanical keyboard that was, but uh, I really loved that that keyboard. Uh, there was a a guy that uh, we knew that had a terminal illness, and so my son and I, my grown son who lives here, we took an old computer we had and an uh, old monitor that we had, and uh, everything, you know, everything that he needed he didn't have a computer and uh, and the stuff was you know working and it was new uh, the only the only thing I re and I had 
older keyboards, but I gave him the, uh, I can't remember which one it was, I gave him the uh, mechanical keyboard. And so when my son and I were carrying it over to his place and everything, I was thinking, I, I wish I'd have given him the other keyboard. So, but I have a bunch of keyboards. I don't know if you can see the monitors, probably have a bunch of, I have a whole bunch of monitors and uh, some that are in other, on the other side of the room and everything, so. I think that's it. I do recommend this. Oh, that was it. Yeah, that was it. Well, nobody in the YouTube video said it. That this was on the Amazon reviews. Somebody, some people said that it was not, that it was warped. I don't see that. I don't see that. But I'm happy with it, and I do recommend it. And thank you, and please give a thumb up. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. Uh, YouTube has a new thing that YouTube producers can do that I would like to be able to do, but you require you have to have 10,000 subscribers in order to have access to that. And I've only got two and a half thousand subscribers. So if you can, please subscribe. Thank you very much.